Who is the God of the Mormons? Is he the same God as in the Bible? Let's compare. The God that Joseph Smith and his successors taught is a man, of the same race as we are, who, although he did sin, earned his godhood while living on a planet just like we do. The Christian God is not a man or even like one, has existed eternally unchanged, and has thus never sinned. The Mormon God used to worship, and is still subservient to, the God of the planet he came from. The God of that planet also came from another planet under a different God, who came from another planet under a different God, so on and so forth into eternity. And by practicing Mormonism to its fullest, men on earth can carry on this process, becoming the same kind of God. The Christian God is totally sovereign in his power, subservient to no one, and certainly no link in an eternal God-making chain. He says, I am the first and I am the last. Besides me there is no God. And before me no God was formed, nor shall there be any after me. It couldn't be any more clear. Mormons need a caveat here that God is only talking about this particular universe, but that's just not in the text. As a man, the Mormon God has a flesh and bones body, is therefore physically limited to one place at a time, can only rearrange matter, not create it, and can only make intelligent beings by physical procreation with the Heavenly Mother. The Christian God created everything, physical and spiritual, from nothing, and therefore is bound by no limitations, including a body. To sum it all up, the Christian God is the all-powerful, self-existent, incomparable supreme being. The Mormon God is merely a superman, a drop in an eternal bucket of gods, more like the demigods of ancient mythology than the God of the Bible. These are not merely different beliefs about the same God, since they are irreconcilable at the most fundamental level, and simply cannot exist in the same being. If one is true, the other must necessarily be false, just another so-called God, an idol. Clearly, Mormons and Christians do not worship the same deity, and therefore cannot share the religious identity of Christian in any meaningful way, since the true Christ and true gospel can only come from the true God. Here's one more important difference. The Mormon God allows those who worship false gods to still go to heaven, even giving them a second chance after death to become gods themselves. The Christian God condemns the prophets, priests, and worshippers of false gods to eternal torment, and does not offer a second chance after death. But anyone who turns to him by believing and trusting in the real Jesus will be forgiven of all their sins and will be saved from eternal torment to eternal life with him.